We have opened up the video vaults tonight. We've tracked down some great footage of Brett Favre talking with Dennis Krause back in 1992. The two of them talked about Brett starting his career in Green Bay. It's Tuesday, an off day for the Packer players, but Brett Favre has spent the afternoon watching film. Now it's time to get into his Chevy Blazer and head to his modest apartment a few minutes away from Packer headquarters. Living in Green Bay has been an adjustment for this Mississippi native. It is as cold as they say it is, but the people here are very nice and yeah, it's, a, it's a lot of fun. Um, plus, I guess when you win in this town, it really goes crazy. And, um, I'm, I'm just having a good time and you know, I hope we can keep it going. I keep things in, in perspective. I, you know, everyone's always, you know, don't, don't let it go to your head. And, uh, you know, it, it, it really drives me crazy because, you know, I'm not like that. You know, I'm just a, a regular guy, just a, a nice guy who, uh, you know, just wants to be one of the guys, whether it's a, you know, with the football team or just, you know, just a regular Joe on the street. The 23-year-old Favre is a bachelor. He has a three-year-old daughter, Brittany, who lives in Mississippi. No, I'm not married. I haven't thought about it. I have a girlfriend back in Mississippi. I uh, don't get to see her very often, but uh, no plans for marriage uh, anytime soon. Music is another passion of Favre's. He has quite a CD collection. What kind of music you like? Anything. I'm, uh, a lot of people call me country, but uh, that's probably uh, my second favorite. Uh, rock and roll, I like rock and roll, country, R&B. Now, we don't know if Brett's musical tastes changed, but he did get married to that girlfriend in Mississippi. In fact, Deanna Favre once told me that Brett was her rock when she battled breast cancer.